Wix booking tutorial. Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up bookings on Wix. So let's get into it. Now, first off, you need to make your Wix account. And if you don't have an account already, you should definitely make one. It All it takes is your Google account or your Facebook account, and you can make it via that, or you can just input your email and have your account. Now, after you create your account on Wix, this is going to be your basic dashboard. And on your dashboard, you can see you have your My Site section, then you have your account section, notification inboxes, and then you have a explore page as well so what you're going to do is you're just going to click on create a new site over here and we're going to get started by creating a booking site for maybe our psychotherapy clinic so let's go a bit specific in this video and make a booking schedule for our psychotherapy clinic so so we can make a booking agency over here and we're going to click on next now you can make this any kind of website and add the booking function it's really just your own preference and i'm going to edit a template or you can use the wix adi which basically is the wix artificial intelligence which can start to ask you a couple of questions and then it picks out specific templates for you and then you can edit those templates but i like to browse through all of these templates myself and then then choose one that I actually like. Now, we are setting up a medical or a psychotherapy clinic and we're going to make a booking company for that. So we're going to look for something that looks professional but not too over the top. And let's just see. This actually looks pretty calming and I actually like this a lot. Although this is an adventure tour company template, I actually think it would fit very well with a clinic or this one as well, uh, this recruitment agency one. This one also looks pretty good. So I'll actually go with this one. It looks a bit more sleek to me. So I'm just gonna click on edit template and it's gonna open up a new tab and this will open up the Wix website editor. The Wix website editor sometimes can take a few seconds to load, but don't worry about that. It usually takes me about like a minute to load the website editor. So just hold on, hang on tight and wait for it to load. Now, once your template has loaded over here, you can see on your left, you have your basic toolbar to add and remove different items. All of your editing options are over here. And on the top left, you have your preview, publishing, and saving options. Now, first off, uh, we're gonna focus on um, just adding our booking options, but I'm just gonna change the name to psychotherapy clinic. So I'm just gonna add my first heading over here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this add section over here. I'm going to select on text. I'm going to go for this kind of title and I'm just going to drag it to the top and I'm going to attach it to the header. Now I will name it Jane's Psychotherapy Clinic. So after that, I'm just going to drag this like so. So it's in one line and now it looks pretty good to me right now. Overall, I think it looks pretty decent, but what you can also do is drag this a bit over here and then select some of the empty space. You can move these pages up a bit because I feel like the distance between the top and this section has gotten a bit too big. So I'm just going to change it up and move it a bit to the top over here. Now I'm going to move this section once more like this. And I'm going to add my text again over here. So like this, I'm going to align it with the rest of my text. And I'm going to do Jane's Psychotherapy Clinic like this. So once you have added that over here, you're going to start customization. So we're going to add a section over here for our bookings, or you can add a separate page as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to leave the home page like this. And I'm going to click on to the pages section over here. I'm going to click on manage pages. Then I'm going to go into the site menu and then I am going to click on add page and I'm going to do a blank page now. So once you have added a new page, I'm going to rename this page into bookings. So I'm just going to click on these three dots and I'm going to rename it to bookings. And I'm just going to click on done over here. Now I'm going to go into my booking section. So this is my bookings page. It's currently empty. And the thing I'm going to do is I'm going to click on add apps on the left over here. And I'm going to go for the Wix booking application. So I'm going to open up the Wix marketplace for different applications. And I'm going to look for booking. I'm just going to search for booking. 
and you're going to find Wix booking over here. So we're just going to load this and you, you're going to add Wix booking. So there are other booking integrations you can add to your Wix website builder, but I find that Wix's own application integrates the best. So I'm going to go with Wix bookings and I would suggest that you go with Wix bookings as well because it is the simplest and easiest to integrate into the already, um, already existing platform of Wix. So we have now added Wix bookings. Now it's being added. Now our Wix booking section has been added. Now you might be wondering where do I actually find the booking service? So we're just going to go into the bookings manager over here and you can click on manage services. Now you can add and remove different services that your clinic or whatever kind of store or platform that you're doing provides and add and remove those services into your Wix booking section. So I'm just going to wait for this to pop up and load. Now you can see over here, my dashboard has been loaded and this is my services center. So I am doing a psychotherapy clinic so I can do one on one. And then you're going to add your booking calendar as well. So you can see on your booking calendar, you have staff and your calendar. So you can view all of your bookings together. So this is going to be your basic booking calendar. It has a time zone and you can make it weekly or daily as well. So you can um, totally track all of your work and all of your bookings on your Wix website as well. And within your booking services, what you're going to do is you're going to name your service. So let's say we have um, one hour therapy or CBT. Let's do CBT therapy. And then you're going to add a subtitle if you want. You can add some description and media. You can add images as well for your service. And then what you're going to do is add a session duration. So this is one hour. And then you have a buffer time as well if you want. Usually I like to add five minutes of buffer time because it can be a bit uh, difficult to manage strict timings. Then you have a price per session as well and you can add that amount. So let's just say the price per session is $50 over here or... If it's in a different currency, so we'll do it 100. And then you can add your business address. You can add your service availability. You can add different staff members as well. So if there are multiple people working in your clinic or whatever kind of services you are providing, you can add different team member names. So you can do Anna. We can do as many staff members as we want. And after that, you just click on save over here. Now your booking listing has been saved and now this is going to be listed as a service that you're providing on your Wix website and people can easily book you from here. Now you can see I've added this to my site and if I refresh over here and if I go to my my site section I can easily go onto my website dashboard and find all of these listings over here. So now I have published my website and if I go onto my book online section over here and I scroll down, you can see on our R services section, I have CBT therapy and I can just click on book now over here and I can get booking. Obviously, I didn't fill out all of the section details, so I can't really actually book a therapy session, but this is how easy it is to add your services to your Wix website from your Wix website editor and a simple integration. And if you're looking to manage these, what you're going to do is you're going to go into your Wix dashboard and you're going to click on select and edit site. And then when your dashboard opens, you can just go into the booking section over here. So as the person managing the bookings, you're just going to go into your dashboard. And once you have entered your dashboard, now once you have entered your dashboard, you're going to see on the left, you have your booking services and booking calendar. So from this section, you can easily manage all of your bookings odds that have been added on Wix. And you can see all of your booking services that you're providing as well. So that was it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful. And and you're now able to create your own custom bookings on Wix. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the YouTube channel and I will catch you guys in the next video.